Hey guys, Pastor Nate here and just recently reading in Proverbs chapter 16 and the overall theme of Proverbs 16 is the way that we think about things and the way that God thinks about things and how we walk through life in light of those things. And just thinking of some of these verses in Proverbs 16, like verse 2, where it says, All the ways of a man are pure in his own eyes, but the Lord weighs the spirits. Thinking, man, okay, so we always think that we're right, right? I mean, that's just the way that we work. We, God, though, sees through all that. He sees our motivations even when we may not know them. And then you go in verse 4 and it says, Commit your works to the Lord and your thoughts will be established. And so, man, rather than thinking about how right my way is, I should be committing my thoughts and my focus and my energy on the things of God and allowing God to dictate my priorities. You go on further, if you get further on in verse 25, it says, There is a way that seems right to a man but its end is the way of death. Man, there's a way that seems right to a man, but its end is the way of death. And you, we contrast that with verse three where we were, commit your works to the Lord and your thoughts will be established. And so really it's about setting our heart and our intention on God. As we set our heart and our intention on the things of the Lord, you know, seek first the kingdom of God and all this stuff will be added as we read later. As we set our intention on God and we commit our works and everything we do to, to, to serving and honoring the Lord, then our thoughts are established because our thoughts are dictated by him rather than us. Because man, there's a way that seems right to me, but that way's end is death. There's a way that, that makes sense to me, but the, the end of that is death. And so I want to commit my works and my thoughts and my energies toward God and the things of God, and then my thoughts will be established. And so go with that today. As you walk through your day, as you walk through your week, as you head into Christmas season, think about prioritizing your life in order of the things that are important to God. What is important to God? Prioritize your life in those things. Loving God, loving each other, you know, spreading the gospel, the good news message, um, um, sharing the love of Jesus with people, living your life in a way that honors God. Focus on those things. Commit your works and your ways to the Lord and your thoughts will be established. All right, go with God. Have a great week. God bless.